Hey guys, it's Maddie. I was just finishing up some of my artwork, which I'll show you guys in a second. And I'm so excited for today's video because I'm going to need your help on my upcoming trip to New York City. And I'm going to be showing you my dance competition makeup plus costumes. I hope you enjoy this video. And if you do, give it a big thumbs up. If you like our videos, make sure to give it a big thumbs up, click the big red subscription button, and click the notification bell so you never miss one of our videos. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is my art. So I'm not gonna show you the one I just finished coloring, but on the back of it, I drew this little person. It was supposed to be me, but it doesn't really look like me because it's way taller than me. And here's what I just finished coloring. It's like some sort of Flower. I, at first I was gonna draw on like a lily pad, but then I'm like, I don't even know how to draw a lily pad, so I'm just going to kind of draw like this hilly mountain thing. So it's kind of like a flower, but like a bush. So I don't know, but I mean, leave a comment down below if you guys think my artwork looks good. I think I did my best on both of them, but I mean, I could have did a little bit better on my person and my coloring for the background because it is just everywhere but I mean I'm not going to judge my artwork because I do think that I tried my very best into doing it and now guys I really need your help because I'm going to New York City to see the KISS concert if you guys forgot and I'm also going to be seeing the New York Yankees game with my mom because she loves them but what I need your help for is some stores to go to because I don't know which stores I should go to. So like clothing stores and or some toy stores that you can go to. And I was kind of getting worried because I thought FAO Shorts was closed because Toys R Us had bought the FAO Shorts. But then once Toys R Us went out of business in the United States, then FAO Shorts closed down. But we found out that they're still open, but they're just in a different location. So I'm definitely going there because last time I went to New York and there, they are literally huge. They even have like a candy section in there. Like it was awesome. I think I found like a Hershey's bar that was like that big. Like, that's pretty crazy. So I'm really excited to see your guys' suggestions on toy stores and clothing stores that I can go to and make sure that they're in the Manhattan area because that is where I'm going to be in New York City. Although I am literally so excited because I'm going to New York next week. Ah, it's literally so exciting because I'm going to be vlogging my entire trip to New York, so I might be vlogging kind of just before we're leaving at the airport, when we're in New York, and definitely FA, FAO Shorts, the KISS concert, and the ball game. Also, if I manage to make it to a store that one of you guys recommend, I will be giving you a shout out in the vlog. And I'm super excited. Like, I can't just stop saying how excited I am. I'm legitimately so excited for New York. It just can't come soon enough. And I just want this week to go by so it can be next week and I can just get on the plane and go to New York City and see my KISS concert and the ball game. Oh, it's gonna be so awesome. Okay, the next thing I am going to be showing you in this video is my dance competition makeup and my costumes. But come here, I want to show you some pictures from my prior years. So here is last year's competition outfit. We did a singing in the rain. This is actually a recital costume because we do have a recital every year. And we were doing the 101 Dalmatians because last year was a Disney theme. Here is when I was super young. So last year was my first year doing the competition. So this was me in my recital costume for my photo for ballet. Again, in the next two photos I'm gonna be showing you, we did not have competition. So this was my hip hop costume for recital. And this was my ballet costume for my recital. And then here's just me, little Maddie, my first couple of years of dance. So here's my costumes for this year's competition. This one is for my tap and it's called Catch Me If You Can and we're being cat burglars. This one is for my jazz and we're being train conductors. And for the bandana, I don't know where to put it so I'm just gonna be putting it around my neck because we haven't went to our first dress rehearsal where there they will show us how to do it. So yeah. And I'm super excited because my first dance competition is coming up in two weeks and we have four competitions this year and for every competition 
competition, we have to do both dances. So I'm really excited for that. So I'm gonna go get my dance makeup on and then I can show you guys what I look like in my costumes and I'll do a dance move from maybe each of my competition dances. Okay, so here's all my competition makeup. I have this CoverGirl eyeshadow, some more eyeshadows here, some organic mascara, this is our lipstick. I have some eyeliner. This is my pressed powder and foundation. I have some CoverGirl blush, a whole bunch of different brushes, and then these are the sponges to apply my foundation. And here's my eyebrow kit. So this has some powder and wax. And this year we have to wear fake eyelashes. I'm not too excited about this. I'm so nervous. It's my first time. These false lashes are my least favorite part about doing this. Like, it just feels like there's a big hair on my eyelash. I just need to like take it off, but I can't because they're my false lashes. Leave me a comment down below. Have you guys worn false lashes and have you gotten used to it? And also let me know, do you like having false lashes on? Right now, I don't like it, but unfortunately I have to get used to it and it's a requirement for a dance competition. All right, well, you just gotta get my lipstick on and then I'll get my costume on. Okay, I have to let this dry and then I'll put the top coat on. It's kind of hard to talk because I don't want to get it all over my teeth. There's my makeup guys, leave a comment down below on what you think, thumbs up, thumbs down. Besides not liking the lashes, I give it a thumbs up, well, two thumbs up. Okay, now I gotta go get my costume on. Okay guys, so here's my jazz outfit on with my makeup, and I'm gonna be showing you my sugars. So we go like this. Except we have to do it way faster and on time with the music. So let me try and catch up to the speed that we actually have to do. And we have to stay super strong the whole time. All right, now let's do my tap outfit. Okay, here's my tap outfit. I almost forgot I need my mask because we're being cat burglars. There we go. All right, 
I'm going to be showing you guys our water ball change exercise. Well, I mean, it's also in our tap dance. So that was my tap costume. Now, time to change into my original clothes. Okay, now that I'm back in my clothes, I'm way more comfy. I still have my makeup on, but I can take that off later. That's it for this video, and I can't wait to see your suggestions for what I should do in New York City. Also, if you don't know, Little Monkey Bee has merch now, so leave a link down below in the video description. And I forgot, make sure you leave a comment down below, do you like my jazz costume better or my tap costume better? I'd have to say personally that I like my jazz costume better. I just think that outfit is really cute. So make sure you leave a comment down below on what one is your favorite and or which one you'd probably like to wear. All right guys, bye, see you next time. The end. Thanks for watching. To join all the fun up in our tree top, please subscribe to Little Monkey Media's channel. Don't forget, if you like our video, please share it and click like. We go banana!